So here's some of my favorite specific techniques for getting children reasoning with coordinates. Say a question like this, some children will be able to calculate the answer and some will maybe find that more challenging, but how can we deconstruct this? Well, first of all, I could take this image and remove everything apart from the coordinate that we're being asked for. And for children to estimate what could the missing coordinate be? What could it be? What couldn't it be? Just recognizing that X has got to be, the X coordinate has got to be Y, more than the Y coordinate and in some kind of a proportion. And then what I might do is actually just introduce the rectangle and then ask, well, what additional information will we need, be needed to be provided with to be able to work out that missing coordinate? I could then introduce one of the coordinates and then ask what information does that give us and what else will we need? What else will we expect to see? before I essentially get back to that original question, deconstructed one step at a time, hoping children will, will therefore have more success. I went from this, this original prompt, so this, this is our end point here. And if I then duplicate the slide and I could take off the, um, the one piece that kind of came before that. So there we go, I'm gonna remove the, the dots and this coordinate there. Um, and then I would duplicate the slide again. And then I just need to remove the other coordinate that that was provided here um, like so and then of course it's just the same thing i would duplicate the slide again um, and remove the rectangle and then i've got that sequence that begins with just the coordinate then we have the rectangle then we have one of the coordinates and then the second one as well a couple of other reasoning techniques i love to use estimate the coordinate points and the red and the blue dots given the black coordinate and for children to spatially reason if that is 8, 12, whereabouts would the red coordinate be and how do we know which information would I work from and the fact it's an estimate means there isn't one child with one definitive correct answer. So that's from IC Reasoning Year 6. Um, another technique that I really like is considering so the coordinates of how many of the vertices can be calculated. Um, rather than even asking what which of the vertices can be calculated for children to think why can these um, vertices can we calculate the coordinates of those vertices and not those ones for example so again you I feel free to pause the video and consider that in more detail and then one of my favorite reasoning techniques is given specific coordinates are they on the inside on the edge or on the outside of a rectangle again another question technique from IC Reasoning Year 6. And again, I invite you, if you want a little longer, to consider that one, pause the video and have a look. Hopefully that's given you lots of ideas for how you can build reasoning in when you're looking at coordinates.